viewers, welcome back. It's me, Dr. Benji FM. Uh, if you want, to, I will say right at the start, if you want to watch this video without me talking over it, there's a link in the description to Football, Manager, uh, Football Manager's official video. For those that do want to see my reaction, and you'll notice I missed out a couple. One was an editing issue. Uh, another one, I was asleep. So, okay. Uh, inside FM 2017, number five, fantasy draft mode. Um... Something I play a lot, so I think it's a bit. This is a good opportunity to make a video reacting to what they've got. Hopefully, we'll use this a lot more this year. I'd love to be able to play with you guys more as well. So it's four minutes twenty long, four twenty. I think uh, Blazer is that the is that the what the kids are? Let's play it, shall we? Right here we go, uh, and I'm excited to see what they've got on offer. Will the shirt be different? Who who knows? I'm excited though. I love these videos. It's not. It's not a different shirt, it's the same shirt. It's a great shirt, but it's not a different shirt. Okay. This way, Joe. This way. Joe. Joe, mate. Welcome to FMT. You got it. My name is Joe Tomlinson. All right, Joe. And today, we're talking about Fantasy Draft. Fant Do you know what would be weird? If he was changing his shoes and we never noticed. Imagine that. I, I can't, was he wearing trainers last time? I can't remember. Fantasy Draft Football Manager's most innovative multiplayer mode oh. returns in Football oh. Manager 2018 Good. with a slicker cleaner look and is loaded right. with more gameplay options for you to prove your managerial ability against your mates mm. the premise of fancy draft or disprove draft is simple you and your mates each assemble a squad from a pool of players yeah each player getting one draft pick per round and then pitting them against each other in a league or cup format oh my god of course if you prefer to test yourself against the ai then you joe you should iron that bit there i'm just saying there's a bit there uh, there look you should iron that bit. Come on, some Miles, get on that. You can compete against a host of celebrities. That's my bloody name. I did not know that was going to be in it. That's me. There I am. That's me there. Dr. Benji FM. We've worked the space. Go on, FM. Renzi's boy. Keith Renzi's there as well. Chesnoy Gaming. And Don Biggins. Me and Don Biggins, mates. Right. And familiar faces Beautiful. The FM community and the world Glasses are spot on. ...of football in an offline Excellent. single player fancy draft. I should clarify, you can do that this year as well. But we'll carry on. So let's take a look at what's new in the mode for 2018. Oh, let's. Look at Possibly me there. The biggest change for Fantasy Draft this year is that you can now play multiple seasons in the league's format. Oh. So you can take your mates on season. So, champ I mean, what a season. I mean, let's focus on that first and foremost. What a season. I mean, work the space has been has, has been mauled there, frankly. It's, a, it's, it's what a year. What a year. After season as well as midterm mm, notice there, drafts. Notice there that Biggin's got the better of me. That's annoying. All competitions which you can okay. think of as your very own fantasy draft transfer windows. If you That was really cool. So there's gonna be so it's not just gonna be one thing now. You can do it over a period of time and there's gonna be fantasy draft transfer windows. I love I love all of that. I love all you of that. If one of your mates wants to join an existing fantasy draft in the next season, you can. So you're not restricted oh. to just the starting managers. So you can add new people the in. The knockout Brilliant. cup has changed a bit too, as two-legged ties have now been added. Oh, I lost but the first leg. the first thing you'll notice Bloody is hell. the new user interface. The okay. new layout is more streamlined than in previous versions yeah. and gives Fancy Draft a very different feel to the rest of football managers. I was going to say it looks very the different. The thing has been designed with streaming in mind. Okay, it's, it's designed with streaming in mind, which is interesting to begin with. It's quite square, what we're looking at there. So, I hopefully there's a wider... For example, okay. the in-game icons have moved to the top and centre yeah. to give streamers the maximum amount of space to work inside the centre of the screen. Okay, that's the good. Player profile screen I hope that while that is true, there's still space for like cameras and stuff. Because obviously when I recorded draft mode, that was one issue. There wasn't space to put that. I want to see the draft screen. It's been reworked too, and only oh, feature nice. information that is pertinent Very slim to fancy lines. draft, yeah, good. such as their position, role, attributes, and star rating. Mm. Speaking of players, you'll now be able to see a graphic depiction Ooh. of your squad size and depth in each position. That's not okay. That's not too dissimilar from the player search function that we've seen, but that's now in a squad lineup. Draft process. It's not just the interface that has been reworked for FM18. There are now more options when setting up a fancy draft too. Okay. For starters, you can now head into a fancy draft game quicker than ever before. Right. With the new quick start option. Okay, what does it do? existing online fancy draft and adds you to it. And for a reason... Whoa, that's, that was... Don't, let's not brush over that. So you can go into it just anyone... So, what? That's very online. Like... You can now be entered straight into someone else's online draft. 
that's a big Quick leap. Start, you can now get help with the draft itself by using the auto pick. Option. I don't know if that's what that meant as I get a subscriber on Twitch. Uh, but I mean, can only get better. Uh, now I've found things can only get can it wasn't planned. Thank you for subscribing, whoever it was. AI will choose players for you based on your formation, favoured club, and nationality. Okay. If you'd prefer to That's create the nice. fantasy draft yourself, then you'll find a wealth of setup options that help tailor the fantasy draft experience to you. Right. For instance, there are more increments between the Here minimum and maximum squad budget, and that maximum budget has been doubled from 250 million to 500 Good. million pounds, meaning you'll be able to draft more of the world's <sighs> top players into your squad. Behind the scenes, me and Work the Space have been asking for that for months, years. Another exciting addition are player pools. These allow you to customise the pool of players that you and your competitors okay. draft from and allow Cleaner you to filter well. the draft pool by such conditions as nationality, value and specific divisions. Joe was very excited about that. You could do that already. These can also be uploaded or downloaded via the Steam Workshop. Of course. Oh, so now you can put you can now that's that that's better because now you can put in pools. Oh, that's really good. So I could now give you a pool that maybe I use in a draft and say, oh, if you want to use the exact same pool that we did, link in the description to the Steam like workshop. That's really nice. Course, good. Small little feature, but good. Pool, if you prefer. Finally, the fancy elements of fancy draft have come into play more than ever before. Jacuzzi, calling it now. We're going to get a jacuzzi each. In a radical change to how things work in the real world, the element of time has no. been removed, so your players won't age. Better still, okay. removing time from fancy draft means that. It Hopefully, does that mean I won't age? That'd be good. Injuries are now calculated in match days rather than weeks or months. Keep Ooh, an eye out for more that was quite subtle. So, you know, no longer is it a three month in injury, it's a three game injury, which is interesting. Episodes of FM TV. And for more information on Football Manager 2018, visit footballmanager.com. Yeah. I like that. Thanks, Joe. That's actually really good. I'm, I'm more impressed by that than I thought I was going to be. Um, the, I mean, the slider for the, the pricing is much better. They didn't mention prices of players. Obviously, they were quite high. That suggests they won't change. Um, the online element, I mean, I need to make sure I heard that right because that was that was a big step that you could quick search. Where was the quick search? Okay, let me just find an existing online fantasy draft and adds you to it. So it adds you to an existing online fantasy draft. Now, from my knowledge, not that many people are playing a fantasy draft. This might encourage it if it's quite quick. If it feels quick and snappy, I wonder, and I have no idea, and they didn't mention it, if that means there's dedicated servers. Because if there aren't dedicated servers, I'm just going to be honest, that's going to cause mayhem. So we'll see if that's the case. Um, I, I would like to think that in 2017 there are. If not, then I guess there isn't. But... Yeah, because if you've got a computer that can't really handle eight people joining your fantasy draft, then that's going to be a struggle if your speed's not good enough, if your computer's not good enough. But um, regardless of that, that was good. I like that. Two-legged tires is quite cool. Mid-term draft as well, which is basically a little transfer window. Like it. Like it a lot. Thank you, Joe, for that. And thank you for the manager. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please do leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe to the channel. What do you think? I'm going to assume most people watching this probably didn't play fantasy draft mode last year. Does this encourage you to do so? Um, I'm excited. We'll see then. Right then, that brings us to the end. If you enjoyed it, with love and care from me, that's a bit chill. So it's time. Goodbye. There's going to be more of these videos, apparently. I look forward to them. Oh, just quickly, if you want I don't know what I thought about tactics. They were good, as was scouting. Oh, did I do that one?